Oh, hi there. This is Janice. Welcome back. If you're new here, hi. Today I decided to do a uh, Ipsy versus Ipsy. I subscribed to a second Ipsy bag just for the fun of it. And this is the smaller bag with the cosmetic bag. I believe this one's up to $13 or $15 a month now, something like that. I bought a yearly on the one, the other one I buy the month to month. One subscription I've had for years. The other one I just had, let's see, but this is my second month. And uh, I thought I'd just do it Ipsy versus Ipsy. So if you're curious what I got in these two bags and how close they go to my profiles, I put on there. Just keep watching. Go ahead and choose a bag. Let's pull this one out. Before I keep going, I would love it if you would subscribe if you like unboxings and I plan to do other beauty related and lifestyle um, content on here. And a little bit about my pets when I have them around right now, they're taking naps. This is one of the bags and I have the other one there. And we'll go ahead and pull this out and see which this profile it is. And let's, mm, let's guess what the heck. Okay, I do know what this month's bag is supposed to look like, and this isn't this month's bag, so we must have ran out of the bags. Since I'm a newer subscriber, it probably is the older ones, I believe. I don't know that for sure. But I still like this cute, it's got lips, and it's so very summery, so it's okay. I will keep half these anyways, so it's not a big deal. All right, let's pull out what I have. Peaky in here is quite full. Let me set this bag. I see there's sometimes there's other things in here. I do buy add ons now and then. Oh, this is an add on, so I'll leave that there for now. I thought I did. Okay, first thing I'm pointing out is this little thing. It looks like it's a little shadow palette. It's by Beauty Vault. And this is what I picked. You do get to choose one item a month to pick, and they give you the dates uh, when you can pick them. So if you hop on there, I think they give you two days to do it. Not they they choose for you. So these are really pretty. There's a brown. And like a, three shimmers and the brown is the matte. So, ooh, it's pretty. This is scum color my skin. Don't mind my wrinkling hands. I can't help it. So, that's that. I always like getting these little palettes, pop them in my purse, or having to go on trips. I pop it in there. I plan on going on more trips. But uh, I went to Vegas and that was fun. <laughs> oh, this is a product from Ace Beauty. Blushed up. Oh, it's a blush. I like Ace Beauty. Really packed good. So it's called Plummy. That's a color. Oh, that's the color for Plummy. Pretty. I love plums. Let's see if I can get over here. Really pretty. Got one thumb left here. I can use my other hand though. Uh, let's see, this two over here. So let's see. It's the color. I'll use that. It's pretty. Sands and Sky, the sky upside down, Australian Pink Clay Deep Pore Cleanser. Okay, this particular product 
it's not really what I would use on my face, but it's okay. It's, um, I'm sure it's very nice. I wish I could. I probably could. I just probably won't. I'll probably give it to my um, teenage granddaughter. She could really use this. So far, two things out of five I can use. Ooh, this is pretty. This is a Libby. Oh, I forgot to mention. I'm kind of mad at myself. They do give you a card every month. And this month's theme is show your colors. And no, it doesn't tell you what it is. So I have to go on my app to tell you about the products. Oh yeah, you feel like a lip gloss. Feels nice. I like these doe foots. They have like a little circle in the middle there. And this is by, if I haven't said already, Jolie. Mmm, smells. Wow, smells yummy. Some fruit. I just pulled a little bit on it. It's not going to get on my teeth. Ooh, it smells. It's not sticky. This feel, just feels nourishing. So that's nice. Alrighty, there's another item I really love. Hmm. Cool. And let's see what this there is. Oh yeah, a mascara. I believe, no, I picked the eyeshadow. Oh, I would have picked this. I think that's one of the choices, but I didn't pick it. But I um, like this mascara. It's um, by Tarte and it's Man Eater. I've had bigger tubes of it and loved it. So this is really nice to throw in my purse because I'm always touching up my mascara on the run if it needs it. I don't, I mean, don't always, but sometimes I do. Okay, that's the five items I got. I got the Man Eater. Mascara. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say Jolie 2.0. I'm not sure if that's correct. But anyway, that's the lip gloss. And we got the clay cleanser. A blush. And eyeshadow balance. I think this box is great. And I'm gonna guess, see my, Original one is I got it all, you know, pr profile according to my age and my likes. But my other one I put myself down as younger with darker hair. I think I did my 40s. I'm not sure what I did. I don't remember. But anyway, um, I'm gonna guess this one to be that. And that one I said I I was, you know, I like makeup. I wasn't that good with it. I like to try it. You know, things like that. So maybe that one. I'm gonna take a little break here real quick. I wanted to show you what I got in my refreshments and I could use what I got in my refreshments right now. So let's go to that real quick before I go to the other Ipsy bag. I hope you don't mind. I do subscribe to their refreshments subscription. This is not a mystery or anything like that. You actually get to choose what you want. You can get them monthly, every two months, every three months. You can stop it certain products for a while, um, change it up. You have full control. And this is what I do. And they're in pay their retail price. And this is not badly priced at all. But I do like these refreshments. I like their Marcellar water, which I got. This is another bottle. I got one upstairs and um, I'm gonna put this, leave this downstairs. I have two makeup areas. Yeah. It's a long story. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> and this is what I, I knew I got. See, I ordered this on purpose. These are the... It's in there, right? <clears throat> this is the cleansing cloth. And that's what I'm going to use right now to get this off my hands. So, I really like these. They're nice and wet. And good job. I like the colors of the packaging. This lavender and chartreuse. I love those two colors. Purple and chartreuse. I love, love those colors. I know, weird combination, huh? I remember uh, my mom always hated the color chartreuse and purple. 
when I grew up and got my own home. I painted my bathroom charger. See that I fit? I hate that. Then I painted my daughter's bedroom purple. She had a fit. I said, Mom, I like it. And I still do. I don't know why she didn't like those two colors. But it reminds me. Those colors remind me of her, so that's a good thing, even though she didn't like them. <laughs> Sometimes I would tease her about it, because I just thought they were gorgeous. She had a chartreuse lampshade once up north in the cabin. Oh, it's so darn pretty. What happened to that? Who knows? Things get old, or get through well. Okay, did a good job. It's still gonna be wet. I love these. I get these every three months. Plenty. Oh, I also get the razors, the razor blades. However, I did put a pause on it for a while because I found when I get older, I don't need to shave my face that often. Kind of lose your hair. One good thing about getting older, your body hair I'm talking about. And I probably had hair, but not me. I'm not so lucky. I have too much hair. And then it cut, I cut it. And I tried cutting it again, it was real crooked. So my sister, finally, she gave me some deep layers, just which I wanted. And it feels healthy now before it's just damaged from all my hair dye. <laughs> all right, back to what I said this video is about another Ipsy. This should be the one, being I think the other one is my younger profile. This should be for me what I am now. And guess what? I got the regular bag. Isn't that cute? I would love to add another one, but you know, like I say, I don't really need it. But this one is cute. It's got a watermelon. I love that color, a pink fuchsia. And it's very light and airy. It's got a hose in it. Really nice for summer. I go into the beach, which I don't do. But the pool. I used to. I loved it. Not anymore. I'm not that pretty looking at me in a bathing suit anymore. And this one also, show your colors, no information on products. That's okay. They do give you an app that you can look up and they tell you what you received and explain it in good detail, pretty good detail of what they are and how to use them. And that's what I do if I have questions. All right, oh, this is what I picked. Um, this is the Hydro Brick Primer from Milk. I've been wanting to try this. I was tickled to death to try a sample because I have lots of primers and I don't need to buy anymore. But I want to try it. So this is a little sample which will give me enough to try and see if I like it. Okay. Put that over here. I don't have my table in front of me because it's out in the garage. I'm using it for my grad stuff. And is something from Sugar, Goddess of Flawless Medifying Sunscreen, SPF 50. Oh. Sunscreen, I can always use that. See, I'm, of course, all ages can use this. But, um, yeah. Yeah, we'll use that definitely. I'm not on the sun much, I don't like it, but I'm planning on going to the fair. I want to go to Traverse City. Get some cherries. They had a cherry festival going on, which is a lot of fun. That reminds me. We work and go tomorrow. Well, I'm gonna go maybe Thursday. Maybe Thursday now, because I just put myself a dog in the room. Oh, that's right. Oh, Kvos Lip Potion, overnight lip mask. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There you go, I'm over. They gave me lots of lip masks, but guess what? I use them. This is new. Um, brand for me. I'm not going to open it, but it is like safety sealed with another plastic over it, so it's nice and sealed. And a couple more things. What will you be? Brow, brow stuff, groom and scalp tinted brow gel. Okay, and you know what? I'm just going through my brow stuff. I don't use a whole lot of brow products. I um, always have really thick brows. And you know, I'm getting low. And again, this is plastic sealed, so I don't want to open it. So I could use this. And it's brand I've not heard of. Color, oh, blonde. Oh, well, all right, it's a little light, but I'll make it work. 
I did tell my hair is blonde, so you can't blame her for giving me blonde, okay? That is my fault. Oh, one more thing. I'm doing here. Fragile. Oh, that looks interesting. It's by Complex Culture, I believe. But that's Ipsy's brand. There it is, whatever you are. I'll read on the back here. Where are you? Sun Bath Baked Bronzer. Oh, it's a bronzer. Wow, it's light. But it goes on nice. Oh my gosh, it's silky. I don't know why I'm smelling it. <laughs> it just smells clean. I really don't smell. I don't know. Maybe it's my hands because I just put some lotion on before I started this. That is pretty. Wow, what a, it goes on darker than it looks. So I thought, wow, that's really light. But. Okay, let's recap real quick. The bronzer, lip mask, eyebrow gel, uh, the primer, and sunscreen. Pretty sure this is my um, my regular one. You know that for years because I notice they rarely um, duplicate things. Once in a blue moon, but I haven't had for a long time. You know, hard to give me a different brand of it. There for a while, it seemed like I was getting a lot of eyeliner, so I kind of complained about it. And they wrote me back and said, you know, that they just give me different brands to try and see what one works well for me. And I thought, oh, what is all that? So I thought, hmm. I could start, I better quit complaining because I found some eyeliners didn't work well for me and the other ones did. So then I looked then I looked at it in a different perspective, you know what I mean? These are supposed to be to see if you like them, that's why the trial size. You know, so that you know again yeah, this subscription is meant for that. So I love the subscription. I love Ipsy. I don't care what anyone else says on this YouTube beauty community. I love it. Even if these are all bad, I still would love it. it just, I mean, I just, I've never wanted to really quit. I've only slowed down. I stopped getting the clam bag because I get boxy charm. I I don't need two of those bigger subscriptions because I have a lot of makeup and skincare, but that's the only reason. Otherwise, I would. And then, but I do get the X. I resubscribed to that, and the last couple of times I got it, and I was very excited about them both because I really like things. So, but I don't get the box and charm box, you know. So I spread myself out just enough to keep me happy. All right, that is my. Oh, I want to show you my add-ons. Duh. Okay, I got an add-on this here. <coughs> I've got a frog in my throat. These were two for five, I believe. I ordered a something from Hip Dot. And yeah, I believe, I believe this shell. Oh, pretty. Okay. Really pretty. It's got glitter in the middle, so I don't want to. I know some people do, but. I still wear it. I don't care how old I am. I like glitter. Don't irritate my eye. I'm even careful with it. It doesn't irritate me, so I'm lucky. Most things don't irritate me. Once in a while, I get something that irritates me. And this is another eye primer. I always love to try different eye primers. So this is perfect. It's by M2U. M2U. NYC. <laughs> See, I haven't heard from the hair. I haven't heard of this brand, but I will be going on my app to research. This video is going to get kind of long if I do all that, but if any time you want me to start incorporating me explaining what the app is like, I'd be happy to do it. I'm just trying to keep for time 
appreciate your time and try not to take too much of it. Just so I wanted to show you what I got for my add-ons. I got the Huda Beauty Coral Obsessions. Never thought I'd... I don't really care for coral oranges, but I thought I'd give this a try. And it kept calling out to me, and I am wearing it today. And when I got it, this only one shimmer was kind of broken up, but I re, you know, I added alcohol to it and re put it back together. <laughs> and it works just fine. It is my favorite color. Um, you know, I didn't know, I started putting it on today and I thought, oh, I don't know if I like it. But I think I like it okay. What do you think? I just realized I didn't put much mascara on. Only a couple coats. I was such in a hurry to get in here, so I have I have my high mascara on. I was gonna put a little more on and now I ended up putting on I think a coat. But oh well. It is what it is. I already did this video. But you I like it. I mean let me see. Let me see the bigger mirror. Oh, okay. That's grown on me. I mean, you can probably see it better than I can. All right, the next thing I got was, what can I get here? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Nail polish. I'm wearing it today, except for my ring finger, I'm not wearing, wearing it. I'm wearing another nail polish. But it's by Fluid, We Are Fluid, and it's real pretty green, it's got I didn't really I guess I had sparkles, it's kind of a silver sparkle and a little bit of texture to it, but I like it. I love nail polish. Uh, what I this isn't from Ipsy, but I just show you what I got on my other finger here. It's by Sally Hansen Color Foil. This is lavender. I like foils. Let's see. And and I got this. I think I got this really cheap. I, mean, I don't know why I ordered I don't think I knew it was so darn big for one thing. Contour. I think I was going to get it to give away. Pretty sure that's why I got it. Okay. Okay, if I can cosmetics, that's huge. I do need to get hold of you to see about this product. I'll show you why here. Keep the suspense up. Volume two, okay. And let me hold it like this. Ah, yeah, it came damaged. Got the mirrors all broken up. I don't know if you can tell. And then these are pans are all crumbly. Okay. Now I can use this, even though the mirror is broken up. This was in it. It's like. I can tell it's not really splintered. I mean, it's splintered, but it's not. No, it's not mixed in the product. So, I won't be giving this away. But I am going to tell them about it. They may make it right with me. They usually do. Or I might just say, I forget it. I don't believe it's very much. But man, it's huge. That's why I'm so surprised. It's beautiful. Okay. Ah, it's crumbly. I'm sorry. I can't hold it up no more. But happened. Things happen. It's not their fault. It was packed really well. But that's shipping for you. My husband used to be in the post office in Australia. And he said some of those things they go through get kind of bogged down and broken or whatever. I'm not sure what they do here. This is just um, an idea. Um, they go through these things and they really smash these packages up. So they go through hell quite blankly to get here so things become damaged so just let Ipsy know and I've never had a problem with making a recover so you know if I don't it's because I didn't bother to it was a no big deal like with the eyeshadow I fixed it I just, no you know it's not that big of a deal to me not this let them know what happened so it, I don't know what they're gonna tell this shipper hey you damaged your products 
nowadays. I don't know. <laughs> my rambling on for. That is my um, unboxings on my two. And I will put, oh, I already know, I, I picked. I do know who, um, which bag was with which. That first one was for my new profile. And then an exit job with that new profile. And the second one did a perfect job too. So I was really happy with the Ipsy. I am most months. Okay, the next section I'm gonna talk a little heart to heart thing about what I feel about beauty subscriptions. So I'd love for you to stay tuned and listen to that. Uh, I know this video is gonna be a little long, but it's been a while since I've uploaded and I've got a lot of things I wanna to talk to you about. So I'm just gonna have a long video. But if you decide to sign up, that's fine. I'm glad you came along and stayed long as you did. But remember to subscribe if you have it. Like this video. Share this video for someone who may enjoy hearing about beauty subscriptions. And also comment. What do you think? And just say hi. I appreciate that. I really um, enjoy hearing from you guys. All right, friends, I'm going to get off here and start the next part. So if you're signing off now, I'll see you in my next video. I have had some things on my mind about the beauty subscription community. I have been buying beauty subscriptions since the year 2015. In fact, years ago, back in my 20s, they used to have a beauty subscription called, what was that called? The Beauty Box, I believe, and also Cosmetic. And I, I subscribed to those, I loved them. And I've always liked the idea of getting something for at a low cost and get a big value. Of course, I've always liked makeup. And when I hear, and then, you know, as years came by, I, I don't know what happened, but I stopped getting them. I don't know if they went on a business or I just, you know, probably had financial problems because I was pretty poor back then. I thought that I'm not now, but. <laughs> so back in 2015, I started watching YouTube. I was looking to figure out how to turn my hair gray. <laughs> it's turning on its own now, but anyway, and then I kind of got introduced into the makeup community, beauty community, and then I started seeing some unboxing. I thought, oh wow, cool, I got, I got the beauty subscription. Okay. So I got introduced to the Birch Box. That's how my first one, and I loved it. And then I found out about Ipsy. And of course, I really loved that. I liked the idea to get a little makeup bag that was just a thrill for me. And then I found um, BoxyCharm. <laughs> that was even better, full sizes, you know? And that's back when it was $21 for five full sizes. And I really enjoyed it. And I look back at some of the products I got, and they were mediocre, but I loved them. I didn't have a whole lot of makeup at that time, and I loved the idea of getting um, skincare and makeup at really deep value. And guess what? I still do. It's been, what, seven years? And the point I'm trying to make is I do watch a lot of other creators on YouTube, and I like and I very much enjoy seeing what they get uh, in their boxes. And I do partake on the sneak peeks. I miss curiosity. I do it just kind of get myself excited. I don't do it because, oh, I don't like it. I'm not going to subscribe next time I'm going to cut it off. I don't do that. The uh, only reason why I would unsubscribe is because of finances. And I have too much makeup, which is a legit problem. Makeup, skincare, you name it. If I ever do an uncluttering, I'm too embarrassed to. I, f I mean, I'm a hoarder of, of the beauty products. But anyway, I digressed. I find now and then some creators tend to be a little negative about what their box is like. They're upset with it. They're upset with Ipsy. Um, 
Birch box was a lot more upset with that. Um, Boxy charm, etc., etc. I don't. I only do Boxy charm and Ipsy right now. Birch box I gave up because I had to cut something somewhere, and I did find. I loved it. I did find the products were a little repetitious for me and very small, and I decided that's just the one I decided to cut. I liked Ipsy because I got a free makeup. <laughs> and of course, boxy charm. Oh man, that was like the bee's knees. I I loved getting full size product. That's how I become to stock up my beauty supplies. And also gave me products to try, and I have loved them for the most part and repurchased. Of course, there are thin products that don't work for me. It's not that I don't like them; they just don't work for me. I am an age quite an aging woman. I'm in my early 70s. I have very dry skin now, not like I had when I was younger. <laughs> and some of the products are, you know, for a mixed age group. So when I get like things for acne or oily skin, of course I can't use it. But for the most part, my um, profile, I do get the things I need. I don't have a whole lot of problem with that. Ipsy really knows me now. They pretty much hit it spot on every time with my personal bag I get from them. It's geared towards me. And I'm always happy. I heard some say that they don't believe the beauty description is gonna last much longer. Oh, don't tell me that because I would be so upset. I don't care how much it costs. If I feel the value, I'm gonna pay that money. Everything's going up. Everything, as you well know. I don't need to tell. You out there who are watching me, that shipping, of course, has gone up. Um, handling fees, they, I mean, the the gas prices alone, they have to charge extra for that. Handling fees, people want wait, their wages increase. Okay, I am a business owner, and we've had to raise our prices, and mainly because. Our employees, we can't keep them. They want to make more money because things have gone up. And it's a vicious cycle. It's gone up and up and up and up. It's getting a little carried away, but that's the time. So I've lived a long time and I've seen this before. I've seen it many times before. This is pretty much what happens in life. So what I'm trying to point out is that I love Ipsy and Boxy Charm. I will probably never unsubscribe. Maybe I will because only because I have too many products. So I just want to give you my opinion about it. I find the positive in the products I receive. And what I don't like or what I doesn't work for me, I either give it away to my family or friends. I had garage sale here and I did bag up a bunch and really charge five bucks for a little bit just to kind of recoup some of my money because it is expensive and uh, also they were tickled to death and they gave me a free cosmetic bag to go with it and explained to them you know that I was doing this on YouTube and they, they thought that was really neat but I just want to end this video with a positive that uh, I hope you out there I'm talking to if you don't care for these descriptions and you do think it's worth about that, this is fine. I understand your opinion and I, 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 uh, and I respect your opinion, but this is just my opinion. I love it. And if you are on the fence about trying it out, just give it a try. You can quit at any time. You're not obligated to keep it going, you know, just join the month to month, if you want. If not, keep on watching me. I am doing more things on my channel because I've only down to two boxes. I do want to do more. I've been very busy with the garage sale and things like that, but I am trying to do more videos that maybe are interesting to you. Like, I really love doing them with my doggies. <laughs> and I love to do some cooking. But, you know, I know I'm kind of digressing off what my channel originally was, but I think a lot of 
creators have done that because of, you know, things change, life changes, so you try to keep with the current trends. So that's what I'm trying to do. And I hope you like this video. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider it. I think it's really great. I want you to watch though, and I want you to subscribe, just subscribe, which you watch, because that really helps me. And uh, how about give me a comment about what you think about these beauty subscriptions? Do you like them? Do you think they're a ripoff? Or do you do you get a few? One or none? Which is fine. Uh, I like trying things out. I especially like Ipsy because of the samples. I don't have to invest a lot of money in what I do give them. I won't be moving what I get most times. All right. All right. I won't keep you any longer. I didn't really respect your time. And uh, love that you decided to watch this video to the end. And if you have watched it to the end, why don't you give me a how about a smiley face? Real simple thing. So I know that you watched it to the end. Alright everyone. I'm gonna sign off now and I will see you in my next video. Bye.